Good evening, good evening, guys. Thank you for joining. Hi, Jorge, no worries, that's okay. Teti, uh, good evening. Hi, Yvonne, how are you? Dalila, good evening, how you doing? Hi, Sylvia, how you doing? So, TGIF, happy Friday, guys, how are you? Hola, Miss. Gracias por el día de ayer, pero lamentablemente se me fue la señal, no pude terminar la, la clase. Ah, pero vaya. hoy estoy tratando de adaptarme y estar viendo con los pendientes del día de ayer. Vaya, súper. Vamos a igual a practicar un poquito eh, parte del vocabulario y parte de la, los temas que revisamos ayer, así que no se preocupe. No worries about it, but me alegra verlos por acá. I'm glad uh, to have you here. Um, okay, Dalila, no se preocupe. Muchas gracias. Be careful, please. I hope you um, uh, get early to your house as well. And I think, um, so guys, los demás están trabajando. Are you kind of working? Hi, Catherine. Good, uh, good evening. Great to have you there. So thank you guys, gracias por conectarse. Yo sé que los viernes are kind of hard. Ya el cuerpo nos pide descanso, but uh, it's really nice to have you. Really nice to uh, have your attendant here. And uh, vamos a hacer un pequeño, uh, I wouldn't say uh, repaso, because en realidad no es eso lo que vamos a hacer, sino vamos a hacer la práctica, right? De los temas que hemos estado practicando this week. Uh, que incluyen expresar deseos, right? Expresamos qué es lo que queremos utilizando would. And uh, vamos a también trabajar un poquito with um, vocabulary para regresar objetos to return objects and uh, eh, cuáles son algunas expresiones that are very common that we can use, right? So, um, no worries, Silvia, that's totally fine if you missed it. Now uh, we will have a lot of opportunities to practice. Mientras el resto de compañeros se van agregando, right, and they uh, join the session, um, I have a little exercise here. Hi, Carlos, good evening. How are you? Great to have you, Carlos. Thank you, guys. So, I know, that's okay. Okay, so we're gonna get started, guys, revisando un poquito de vocabulario. And uh, si me ayudan with this one, that would be very nice. So give me some word. Wait a second. So uh, we're going to like check a couple of pictures, right? We're going to like uh, check them quick. But uh, give me one second. Give me just a second. I'm going to need your help. Okay. And uh, I want you to think about some words que podemos utilizar para describir esas pictures, like to describe the following pictures. Give me one second. Ahorita se las muestro. Let me just show them over to you. And okay. 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 So um, the idea is just to say a word. So vamos a intentar, right? We're gonna try to uh, give cualquier descripción que podamos, any description we can based on these pictures. So take a look at the first one. We have a knife. So guys, what can you tell us about a knife? So, ¿Cómo lo describirían? How would you describe it? What are the characteristics? Um, ¿Para qué se usa? When do you use it? What do you use it for? Uh, guys, ayúdenme con la descripción, please. Podemos decir, uh, it is right para describir las características. Or we can use, um, so you can, right? And podemos hablar de qué es lo que podemos hacer con el knife, etc. So, Carlos, what can we do with a knife? Ceci, what can we do with a knife? Uh, 
si no saben cómo decirlo, that's totally fine. Ayúdenos. Eh, you can say it in Spanish y los ayudamos acá, right? So, guys, this word is called knife. ¿Qué hacen con los cuchillos, guys? What do we, you do with this? Cortar, partir. Okay, okay, exactly. Now, como digo estas expresiones en inglés. So, you can, how do you say cortar? So, you can cut. Uh, ¿Qué más pueden hacer? What can you do with a knife, guys? There are a lot of things, right? Hi, Ms. Maya. Good evening. Great to see you here. Good evening. How are you? I'm good. Great. It's really good to hear. Really, really good. Um, are you in San Miguel today? Yes, I'm here. Okay. Is it raining? Is it raining in San Miguel too? No, no. Or is it like uh, as every day, like very hot? Very hot. Oh my God. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay, we will send you some rain. <laughs> yes. We'll send you some water. All right. So, um, oh, Mr. Amaya, what do you use a knife for? Uh, so I got this picture of a knife. Um, how would you describe a knife? How can I describe a knife? Yes. What do you use it for? To cook. Okay. Uh, to cook meat. Um, I don't know. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> That's okay. So, um, guys, there are like a lot of uh, expressions we can use. Vamos a intentar describir también. Algunas cosas, like, sin el diccionario, right? Uh, for example, um, para describir eso, puedo decir, it is an object, right? It is a person, um, or it is a place, so podemos ir describiendo different things. And it is an object that you use for uh, cutting meat, you said. Maybe peeling, para pelar los vegetales, peel, to peel the vegetables. Um, to open, to open boxes, right? And to cut anything. <laughs> so that's the one that we got. Um, all right, thank you guys. Let's go with the next one. Take a look at the cat. What comes to your mind when you see this cat? ¿Qué se les ocurre, guys, with this cat? What characteristics do you see over there? Nothing? <laughs> no ideas with the cat. How would you describe it? A fluffy kitty. Oh, that was a really nice expression. So kind of fluffy. Okay. You have a lot of vocabulary. <laughs> That's really good. Okay. It's very fluffy. Okay. He's nocturnal. Ah, okay. So it it is a night. I don't know how how we could say that. Like it's not a night. Oh, mm, okay. It is more active at night. So it is more active at night. La palabra que um Mr. Amaya mentioned was fluffy, right? Como esponjoso, como rellenito, right? Like uh, like a lot of um what hair kind of hairy too okay 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 so it's fluffy it's a night animal or it is more active at night hi sylvia good evening so i see that sylvia is telling me. hi teacher how you doing very good <laughs> good to hear that that's really nice Eso suena como las vibras de viernes right <laughs> yes <laughs> that sounds like okay <laughs> Okay, so anything else about the cat, guys? Anything on it? Are they Naughty. clean animals? Yes? Naughty. Travieso. Ah, okay. So the, okay, yes, the, they are. Teacher, eh, yes. ¿estamos viendo los nombres eh, de muchos animales o 
Amy, ¿qué significa? Uh, no, actually it's like name any word. So es como, eh, solo descríbalo, right? Eh, mencioné palabras que utilizaríamos eh, to describe the picture. Ah. Or, uh -huh, o cómo describimos, para qué sirve, or like anything. Uh -huh. Ah, okay. okay, so, all right. So you say that they are like uh, naughty. Okay, so yes, they are naughty. Son bien juguetones, I think, or no? Yes. Playful? Yes. Yeah, yes. right, they are very playful. So son juguetones, okay. Se eh, estoy traviesos, no sé cómo se dice travieso. Uh, actually, yes. Uh, ¿Cuál era la palabra, Silvia? Or maybe you can, you can write it. Silvia la tenía lista. Silvia Inés no, la tenía, perdón. Sí. Silvia Inés la tenía lista. <laughs> no, And, sí. Okay, thank you. That's the one. So, Nori. Eh, estoy entre Silvia Estela y Silvina, you know. Sorry, teacher. <laughs> no, don't be sorry. That's really nice. Okay. Um, all right. So, yeah, they are playful. They are naughty. Come on. What else? Do you like cats? I don't like cats. I like cats, teacher. <laughs> you like cats, too? I like cats, yes. Why? Eh... eh Ah, uh, it, it is the uh, friendly. Friendly? Sí, yes. Okay. It is the, eh, ¿cómo se le llama eso? Ah, lo que decía yo, travieso. Uh, naughty, naughty mm -hmm. or we can use the word playful. Mm -hmm. Ah, uh -huh. so naughty right. or playful. Yes, uh -huh. Uh -huh. Pero oh, hay okay. una razón, ay, perdón que no pueda decirlo en inglés, pero hay no, una razón no que no comprendo en los gatos. Eh, ellos, ellos, eh, usted percibe que le quieren dar amor, eh, pero de una forma distinta. O sea, ellos no, 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 no sé de qué manera, pero hacen que usted conozca, reconozca que ellos están felices. Okay. Y, son, y son bestias porque si sí, una vez vino una veterinaria y mi gato por defender al otro, pues le pegó eh, un arañazo que oh. hasta el dedo le pasó llevando, pero sí, me decía la, 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 la ¿cómo le llaman? Veterinaria, de que ellos creen que son, eh, no, ellos son los dueños de nosotros, ellos son los amos. Oh, ok, ok. Uh, I, I don't know, you know, that's a really good point. So, by a cat lover, so tell us, <laughs> give us some ideas, because I have not had a cat yet. So, no uh, he tenido gatos. I have uh -huh. never had them and not like cats. Uh, uh -huh. That's the, the point. So, yeah, teacher. Yeah? I, I read that. Hi, teacher. I read that the cat, how do you say, la mer? Mm, lick. That's lick. The finger for the, the, the own. Uh, they pretend that they are in the manada. How do you say manada? Mm, like a, well, but I, oh, I don't know. A pack, maybe, but pack no sería de gatos. Es que los gatos no tienen, wait, maybe pack, we can call it. Let me investigate if there is a word. Okay. But but I didn't understand. They lick their the finger, finger or they the lick finger, your finger? The finger of the owner of your finger. Oh. Oh, really? Yes. Okay. Like you are family, something like that. Uh huh. Yes. For for the cat is 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 the part of the group. If you lick the finger, that's new for me. Okay, I didn't know. But I love dogs because they are very friendly. They are super loving. But cats are like I don't know. <laughs> They don't like to be touched and uh -huh, sorry. You can tell us guys, um, you know more than I do. So ustedes tienen la experiencia. Who has had cat? Or who has cat? ¿Quién tiene gatos, guys? Nobody? Me. Oh, okay, so what do you think about it? Or do you have any, any special... Uh, fact that you want to uh, share with us um no um my cat is very uh easy 
easy to deal with. Yes. So it's not a like. Let me let me let me find a word to describe it. So it is not like naughty, mischievous, um, or I don't know, deceitful. Probably <laughs> is it a girl or a yes. boy? Girl. Okay. Okay. But the thing is that I have a dog too. Ah, okay. Do they have a good relationship? No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what do, okay uh, so how do you deal with that mm, i can deal with that so uh, that's really difficult i think do yes because they... the the the, uh -huh. the dog it's a girl too but it's uh -huh. very crazy okay and the cat uh, no they she loves to um um bother the cat oh so she's yeah. like teasing the, the each yes. other <laughs> yeah okay oh that's really interesting oh, like yes. i couldn't i couldn't <laughs> be with that feeling that oh my god the, the dog is going to do something to the cat so <laughs> okay okay interesting so all right uh, definitely i'm not a cat lover guys i'm sorry about that Okay, so I got the next picture for you. Uh, let's take a look at it. And we have some food. So guys, what's your favorite uh, flavor or what's your favorite kind of ice cream? Chocolate. Okay, so chocolate. Do you have a favorite place where you buy ice cream? Boston. Boston, what's your flavor? Yes, Boston, <laughs> cookies and cream. <laughs> Cookies and cream, okay. But uh, but I love Yao Yao. Oh, but that's yogurt, isn't it? Yes. Okay, I have never tried that, but the I really like the Boston ice cream, like the cookie ice cream, uh -huh, but not Yao Yao. All right. Guys, what about the rest of you? Do you have a favorite place? Or do you prefer the, the handmade uh, ice cream? Like the artesanal one, the handmade one? Yes, I love that too. All right. I think Sandra uh, wants to share something. Tell us, Sandra. <laughs> Sorry. I oh, like okay. to go some uh, ron con pasas and chocolates. Oh, okay. And okay. I'd like to artesanal. Yeah, that's really delicious, right? So, right. have you ever tasted? Uh, we can call it handmade, right? That or traditional, or yeah, artisanal for that one. Um, is there a flavor that you have tried that you say, "Oh, this is different. This is good." Like I in the yeah. How do you say carbon? What coal? What? Okay, wait, that's charcoal, but, 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 aha, uh aha, -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. explain that to us. <laughs> I don't know, it, uh, it's a handmade, but it's carbon, it's a carbon activado, it tastes delicious. I don't know what is the, the ingredients, but the, for, is it black? Yes, black. Okay. I mean, because charcoal is charcoal um and now a lot of uh, a lot of things um de hecho el charcoal eh, se usa mucho you know para um tratamiento dental so y para like la, la pigmentación de la piel but i have never heard that in an ice cream si he probado pasta dentales con charcoal like con carbón right but Okay, that's interesting. Where, where did you taste it or where did you buy it? In Typical Smart uh, had a, a many years ago, no? Had a, ah. a item, but I don't remember the name of the, the, the branch. Oh, okay, okay. So we can, we can look for that. That sounds really interesting. That's good for me. 
Uh, guys, what about the rest? You're not into ice cream? Maybe I'm not. So I like mommy snow. Oh, like a snowy. No, la nieve. Okay. Oh, I like my mayos, but <laughs> I have never heard an ice cream like that. Oh, okay. Here in the country. Yes, in Boston. Oh, that's new for me. Okay, okay, sounds interesting. Guys, there are a lot of things I'm learning with you, so very nice, okay. <laughs> Sounds good. I had never heard Amame ice cream, but I really like the fruit. So, okay. Let's take a look at the next one, guys. Look at the shark. Um, what can you tell us about this animal? What are your thoughts? Have you ever seen the shark movies? Do you like sharks? No, I don't no. like. What do you think about sharks? What is your opinion on them? The shark is dangerous. Okay, I they are dangerous. saw the, the old movies. Ah, uh, yeah, that's <laughs> right. And TV. Yeah, I am like a teacher. Four or five. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I, I, se llama esto? No temas, ¿cómo se dice? Ay, ¿qué? Don't be afraid. Ay, sí, pero, pero me da temor. Ay, ¿qué le digo? No sé. Es que me da temor ese animal. Una vez lo tuve cerquita. Oh, so no I am scared. So we can say I am scared or I am afraid. Not fair, uh -huh. Uh -huh. Fear. Uh -huh. I am fear. afraid of sharks. We can uh -huh. say that. So, ¿a dónde los vio? Where did you see them? Ah, uh eh... -huh. In, in, um, uh, in the vacation in the Belize. Ah, yes. Mm -hmm. I heard that you can swim with sharks. Yes, in the, ocean. Sí, in the ocean. In the ocean, the is uh, I I don't like the the, the tea room. <laughs> you don't like sharks at all? I, okay. I, I don't like sharks. <laughs> okay. I want to swim with sharks. <laughs> that sounds really interesting. Okay, okay, but well, very nice. That's a really good opportunity, the one you have. Okay, guys, so let me show you the next one. We are almost done here. And we have the following. I think I have Juan here. Hi, Juan, good evening. Thank you for joining. And I have a Superman. Hi, Joel. Good evening. Let's see. Good evening, teacher. Hi. Hello, guys. Hi, Cesar. Great to see you. And I got... Yes. Okay. Um, so, guys, what do you think about Superman? Do you like this uh, superhero? What are the abilities? What can Superman do? He can fly. Okay, so he can fly. He can save the the people. Oh, okay, okay, yeah. He's strong. He is very strong, okay. Superman is very strong. Okay. Uh, and, and he can fly. Okay. And he is very, very fast. That's right. He is very fast. Okay. Only, only. Okay. He can stop bullets, right? So, uh, puede tener como las balas. He can stop bullets and um, a lot of things. I don't remember, but he has a lot of skills. And the last one, guys, we have right here is the following picture. Hi, Ivan. Good evening. That is a motorcycle. Guys, do you like motorcycles? Good evening, teacher. Hello. Good evening. 
Are you into motorcycles? Ceci, you mentioned that you ride a motorcycle. What is your motorcycle brand? Or what kind of motorcycle do you have? Creo que vi a Ceci hace un segundo, but she's gone. Okay, guys, what about you? Uh, Alguien anda en motocicleta? Do you ride a motorcycle? Nobody. Do you like motorcycles? No, teacher. No. No, I don't like it. <laughs> Only I, I go to a motorcycle for my work. Only if necessary. But oh, okay. I, my son has one. Ah, okay, okay. So he has a motorcycle. Ivan, I'm sorry, no lo logré escuchar. Can you say it again? Can you repeat? Sorry, teacher. Oh, it's fine. I'm sorry. Creo que le escuché. Creo que mencionó algo, but se cortó and I couldn't hear you. Eh, tengo un poquito mala la señal, teacher. Me cortó un poquito. Ah, okay. Oh, okay, okay. No worries. That's okay. So thank sí. you. Decía que solo en bicicleta. <laughs> ah, okay. So just bicycles. All right. Pues sí, sí. pero su trabajo está bien cerca. <laughs> It's very sí. close. Uh -huh. Okay. <laughs> Guys, um, what are the characteristics of a motorcycle? It is flash. Okay. Is is meter. Okay. Que okay, más guys? What else? Some are fast. More okay. than the cars. Yes, they are economic too, right? Motorcycle is, is dangerous. It is if dangerous. Big no use quick uh -huh. no caution. Yes, that's a really good point. Okay, so they are dangerous. Anything else? They are fast. They are dangerous. What else? The sound is a noise. <laughs> <laughs> Why? No, it's really nice. Especially no. uh, like uh, ninjas, you know, and, and the, those ones. <laughs> yes, but the another, no. <laughs> Okay, okay, that's a really good point. Okay, guys, very nice. So very good job with the description. That sounds really cool. Antes de seguir, revisemos un poquito these words. Algunas de ellas, eh, creo que son nuevas. They may be new. Uh, así que let's take a look at them. Um, no vamos a revisarlas, all of them. Pero sí quizás algunas de las que son más utilizadas, right? So give me one second. Eh, vamos a crear vocabulario. That's very important. And I'm going to write here part of the um, words that we have. So take a look here. Guys, eh, primero repitan conmigo. Please repeat with me. And let's take a look at those. Eh, esta palabra la podemos pronunciar como no, naughty or lo más común es naughty. So guys, repeat with me. Naughty. 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 Sí, Nori, no se complique, right? No la lean. <laughs> Solo digan Nori porque se escribe nori. bien diferente. Uh, naughty, uh, that's okay, or Nori, that's the most common, right? No. Eh, eh, just be careful. Esta palabra Nori sí es como malo, como eh, se hablamos de los gatos, right? Eh, sí es como juguetón, pero también puede tener una connotación fuera de contexto, right? or just hacia algo más eh, sexual. So just be careful with that, right? Uh, the next one, esta sí lo utilizamos for animals, for people, and this is playful. Guys, repeat with me, playful. Playful. 
Okay, mm -hmm. so playful is that juguetón, right? A person, an animal uh, is the same word. We have lick. Guys, let's repeat it. Lick. Lick. Mm -hmm. Very lick. Very good. Que es lamer, right? Como los gatos. They lick. Um, lick. Own, owner. 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 So, what is the meaning of owner? Owner. What is that? Owner. Es propietario, guys. El dueño. propietario, el dueño, exactly. So, yo puedo preguntar, ¿quién es el dueño de esa casa? Who is the owner, right? Who is the owner of the company? Uh, we have the word fluffy. So, let's repeat it here. Fluffy. Fluffy. Mm -hmm. So, fluffy, I'm sorry. Se me fue una L. So, fluffy is like esponjoso, grande. Um, se usa también para personas para decir como estoy rellenita, right? <laughs> eh, pero en un sentido bien, bien tierno, let's say. So kind of fluffy. Uh, now, this one. Vamos a hacer el sonido un poquito largo. So let's say cat. 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 Okay. So abramos cat. la boca un poco. Ajá. Uh -huh. So cat. 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 Esa sí es un a. Ah. Cat. 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 Yes. Porque hay muchas palabras que se parecen, right? So that's cat. Uh, next one. Deal with. Deal with. Deal with. All right. Deal with. And I am afraid of. I am afraid of. Okay. I am afraid of. Okay. Very good. Vamos a dejar estas palabras de lado y vamos a enfocarnos ahorita en las últimas dos. We're going to focus in the last two expressions, yeah. que son deal with and I am afraid of. Deal um, so deal with es cuando yo digo algo que manejo, right? Algo, eh, le preguntaba a Mr. Maya, how do you deal with the cat and the dog? So es como manejamos algo, right? Eh, so... Guys, ¿qué es lo que ustedes normalmente tienen que lidiar con? So, let's make a sentence. For example, I deal with my co-workers uh, every day. So, todos los días debo a lidiar con esto. <laughs> okay. Uh, ¿Con qué es lo que ustedes um, tienen que lidiar every day? Or con el tráfico. I deal with uh, traffic jam. Con mi jefe. Every day with your ah okay I deal with my boss every day all right. ¿Con qué tienen que lidiar, guys? What do you have to deal with every day? Give us examples. Piensen en qué es lo que les da eh, más dolores de cabeza. Mi jefe. Okay, your, okay. So I deal with my boss. Okay. With my grandmother. Oh okay okay. I deal I with get up earlier. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> so it's like, me levanto, no me levanto. Okay. <laughs> yeah. okay. Seven o'clock. What? Yes. Oh, Mr. Amaya. <laughs> no, and no. I get in at eight o'clock, but I arrive um eight thirty, okay. eight forty-five. <laughs> Wait, I have a question. Um, yeah. are you your are you your own boss? No. Okay. <laughs> okay. Genial. I like your job. Okay. <laughs> okay. So con qué más tienen que lidiar, guys? So I deal with well in este caso, Mr. Maya sería I deal with myself. <laughs> okay, so yo lidio con mis propios eh, yes. feelings or difficulties. Okay. I creo que hay una canción que I deal with myself. I don't remember. Okay. Okay. Uh, ¿Con qué más lidian, guys? What else do you deal with? Con la existencia. Y, pues sí, pero... <laughs> okay. No, normalmente eso... Okay. Preguntas existenciales. <laughs> okay. No, but we can have like, con el clima, with the weather, con la comida, quienes eh, son alérgicos. Do you deal with food or the traffic. para quienes tienen niños, with children? Caesar? The traffic. The traffic, exactly. So those are the things. 
And the next one, guys, tenemos I am afraid of. So, I'm afraid of is like, ¿a qué le tengo miedo? What are you afraid of? ¿A qué le tienen miedo, guys? I'm afraid of snakes. Okay. A no tener dinero. <laughs> okay, but in English, in English, como lo diría, mm -hmm. how would you say that? Mm -hmm. I not have, ¿cómo se dice? Podemos ponerle not having? Not having money. Ajá, uh -huh. exactly, very nice. Or I'm afraid of being poor. <laughs> so, ¿a qué le tienen miedo, guys? What are you afraid of? I'm afraid of snakes. Okay, I'm afraid of snakes. Okay, just as snakes or worms too. O también los, uh, los gusanitos, worms too. In my case, only snakes. Okay, snakes. Spiders, guys, are you afraid of spiders? No. I am afraid of uh, Ladrones? Ah, thieves. Okay, I'm afraid of thieves. Okay, thieves. All right. Um, you know, in my case, it's really crazy because I am afraid of toads. No sé si saben que son toads. They are animals, um, like like a frog. So I'm afraid of frogs and toads, and I don't like them. Because uh, veo uno y siento que se me va a tirar, so I'm like, eh, yeah, I don't, I don't really like frogs or toads. What about the rest, guys? ¿A qué le tienen miedo? What are you afraid of? I'm afraid of death. Oh, okay. So that's deep here. Okay. Yes. Siento que es catarsis, guys. <laughs> okay. Okay, very good job with this. So just remember, I deal with esa palabra, esa van unida siempre, right? Como yo manejo esto o yo lidio con esto, so I deal with. Y si es como tengo miedo a algo, eh, voy a utilizar I'm afraid. Now, hay dos formas. Ahora vamos a practicar afraid sin el of. Les explico por qué. I'm afraid of es tengo miedo a algo. Pero si yo vengo y le quito el of y solo lo dejo, I am afraid, sin esta expresión, ya no es que tengo miedo. So, for example, imagine that, uh, imagine that you're selling something, van a vender esto, right? Van a vender algo y dicen, ay, me temo que ya no tenemos producto. Me temo que no tenemos esto en existencia. I'm afraid the product does not exist anymore. Okay? Or we don't have more stock. So take a look at the difference. Le quitamos of y el significado cambió totalmente, right? So I'm afraid pasó de tengo miedo a la expresión solamente, ah, me temo que ya no hay, right? Pero no es que yo tenga miedo, sino que lo siento, right? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. The product doesn't exist anymore. Ya lo vamos a practicar. We're going to practice uh, these expressions, but eh, quería mencionarlas because they are very important to have them clear. Miss, las dejo por acá. Dígame, Miss. ¿Cómo se dice afraid, eh, vi, eh, los accidentes? I'm afraid of... Ah, eso sí llevaría o oh, porque es como yo le tengo miedo, right? Eh, mm -hmm. Tal vez of having an accident. I'm afraid of having an accident. Como me da miedo tener, right? Un accidente. Yeah, me too. Me too. I, I agree with this. So again, guys, si le quito el love, ya cambió la expresión. So I'm afraid is no tengo miedo, sino me temo, right? So it's a little different. Okay. Tengo miedo que no hay producto. Uh -huh. Or like, um, <laughs> me temo que eso no que es no posible. Hay producto, sí. Me temo que no hay producto. I'm afraid there no. is no product. Me temo que no puedo ayudarle. <laughs> I'm afraid I can't help you. Entonces, ya cambió, right? The expression changed a little bit. So, let's practice this. Um, yesterday, estábamos revisando un poquito de wood, right? Estábamos eh, 
haciendo un par de preguntas con invitaciones. We were trying to invite people as well and para practicar cuáles eran parte de los deseos that you have or las invitaciones. Eh, solamente, guys, take a look at the questions here. Uh, revisemos un poquito de qué es lo que vimos el día de ayer, right? Decíamos que would es para invitar a alguien o para ofrecer. So take a look at these questions. Would you like to watch the latest Star Wars movie tonight? Eh, obviamente estoy invitando a alguien, right? I'm inviting somebody. So let me just um, underline a couple of words. All the demás creo que están fáciles. Okay. So um, guys, repeat with me, please. Let's take a look at this one. Repitan conmigo. Latest. 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 Intenten comprenderlas, qué les está preguntando, qué información queremos, right? And let me know si hay alguna que no comprenden. Let me know if there is anything you don't get. Va a ser ya good. Teacher. Teacher. Dígame. Yes, es, yes. Per, perdón, no sé qué pasó. El sistema me sacó, pero me tocó volver a entrar porque cuando vine a ver este no estaba dentro de la, de la clase. Una, una consulta, okay. teacher. Dígame. Este, ahora estuve hablando con una persona y uh -huh. se pronuncia Wolf eh, o Wolf. Wolf. De, de hecho, eh, esa, es, esa es una muy buena pregunta. First. Hay sonidos en inglés que no se pronuncian. Este es el caso de la L. Esta uh -huh. L nunca uh -huh. se va a pronunciar. We're not going to pronounce it. Uh -huh. So, en realidad lo único que hacemos es cerrar los labios. Uh -huh. Y la doble B suena como casi una B. So, es would. Uh -huh. Would you like? Would. Would like. Uh, would. Uh -huh. would like. Uh -huh. So, it's like would. Just like that. Would you like? Would like, would you like. Uh -huh. Ajá, would you like. So la L no se pronuncia. Eh, es el mismo caso con could, right? So could, no pronunciamos la L, could. Um, uh -huh. Con should es lo mismo. La L no se pronuncia. Should, uh -huh. could, and would. Ajá, so en ningún escenario se pronuncia la L. Ah, de acuerdo, gracias. Uh -huh. You're welcome. Okay, uh, that's a very super nice question. I like it. Okay, uh, preguntas, guys, questions. Entienden las preguntas? Do you understand the kind of information? Yes, teacher. You need to give? Yes. yes. Okay, perfect. Now, estas preguntas no las puedo responder con yes. <laughs> Ni con no. Tengo que dar información. If I ask you, would you like to watch the latest Star Wars movie tonight? Si alguien los está invitando, eh, ¿cómo le respondería? I'm sorry, but I don't like that movie. I like it. Ok, ok. Pero si, si les gusta, <laughs> how would you answer that? Yes. I like to... I, I like to like. I like to Yes, sure. It's very nice movie. Ok, exactly. So, cualquier respuesta, it's totally fine. No lo vamos a limitar a yes or no. And give extra information, right? So, si es un yes, normalmente es porque me gusta, porque sí quiero. Entonces, podemos decir las expresiones que ustedes ya mencionaron, like, sure, eh, I would love to, I would love to, right? Me encantaría. 
or, oh, yes, I really love the movie. So I really like it. And podemos siempre dar extra information. Si es un no, no decimos no. <laughs> Porque suena demasiado eh, cortante, right? And uh, so podemos decir como, sorry. Oh, I'm sorry, but I don't like it. Or la expresión que veíamos hace un segundo, I'm afraid, right? Um, so, for example, a mí no me gustan las de Star Wars. Pero, Thank you, but I'm afraid I don't like those movies. So, sorry, I am afraid. Pero sin el of, acá no lo vamos a utilizar. So, remember that I'm afraid es como me temo que, right? Me temo que no me gusta, me temo que no estoy interesada. I'm afraid I don't like it. I'm afraid I'm not interested. And I'm afraid that's not my thing. Whatever you want to say, es como... Lo siento, right? Another way to say I'm sorry. Okay, guys, so vamos a practicarlas. We're going to practice uh, these questions. We are going, I'm going to send you to groups. And solo le voy a pedir una cosa super importante. Let's keep it full English. So, si un compañero les pregunta, eh, den su respuesta. And intenten la darle en inglés. Eh, no importa que se traben, no importa que se equivoquen, no worries. Lo importante es empezar a armar ideas, right? And, uh, y ver si vamos traduciendo, o si lo que necesitamos es más vocabulary, o si solo es que me cuesta ordenarla. So, please keep it English, guys. So, give me one second. I'm going to send you for the air. Oh. Wait a minute. One. Okay, guys, so I'm going to send you to some groups para que podamos practicar. Eh, algunos eh, creo que han estado teniendo problemas en las sesiones en anteriores me he fijado que eh, lo saca del sistema o no pueden ingresar a los grupos entonces nos vamos a quedar acá eh, guys si les aparece la invitación démosle aceptar please and let's go en algunos eh, nos quedamos acá but el, el, les voy a dejar el micrófono right so you can participate so Mr. Maya nos quedamos acá Iván quedémonos acá too eh, Jorge I think he's working but let's stay here Uh, Juan Antonio, you will stay here. And Silvia Estela and Silvia Inet, nos quedamos acá. We we'll stay here. Guys, los demás, let's go to the groups. Si alguien tiene problemas con la conexión, let me know. Eh, para que también se puede quedar trabajando acá, right? And that, that'll be nice. Okay. So in the meantime, guys, activate your microphones, please. And let's discuss the questions. Les dejo las preguntas por acá para que las puedan discutir. Intenten dar tanto detalle como puedan, as many details as you can, and as many or as much explanation as possible. So guys, go ahead. Um, Silvia Estela, if you are ready, eh, puede entrevistar yes, a los compañeros. Comience a preguntar. Eh, ah, le voy a ceder. <laughs> <laughs> le voy you. a ceder para que usted entreviste a los demás, you know, and uh, mm -hmm. you can decide what questions you want to ask. Pueden okay. inventarse más preguntas with no problem. Ah, ya, yeah. bye. Entonces, eh, hi. Hi, hi. Hola, hola. Hi. Hi. Hi, Silvines. How are you? Hi. <laughs> Silvines, uh, could you like to watch the latest Star Wars movie in the morning? No, I like. No. Uh -huh. uh, uh -huh. uh, movie, the Star Wars. Ah, ah. Uh, do uh, could you like to watch the movie in the date? Um, I like movie. Um, 
ahí. Eh, en el eh, día, ¿a qué hora en el día le queda eh, para ver las movies? Um, Sería, what would you like to watch the movie? Eh, Sería movie, ¿verdad? In the date. Uh, in the morning, in the afternoon, in the night. In the, in the afternoon. Ah, en la tarde. Uh -huh. Vamos a hacer la otra pregunta. Uh -huh. Sería, what could you like to move it to the sirenita? <laughs> Vamos a cambiar, como dijo la teacher, que podíamos cambiar. <laughs> Yes, yes, of course. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. yes, I like the movie. Uh, um, the movie. Infantil. Why, um, why would you like the Sirenita? Is the romantic? Is a uh, yes. romantic uh, action? Uh -huh. Um, Depends. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Is the but the the new movie the the mermaid. Uh -huh. Ya salió. Is it on? Is it ready? No, 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 no. Sirenita, oh. sirenita, sirenita. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, because the thing is that hay una nueva, right? But, uh -huh, uh -huh. like, eh, la que todos estaban hablando. But, <laughs> I was like, wow, que, que descontinuado estoy de movie. <laughs> okay. okay, creo que también está por acá Ivan. So, Ivan, no sé si está listo. How you doing, Ivan? Uh -huh. Are you working? Juan Antonio creo que también está acá. And no sé si Juan está trabajando. I don't know if she's working. Ah, vale. Mm, Entonces sería, más, les... no sé por qué será que no me aparece eh, la información de quiénes estamos. Mm, no aparece, es, va. Está en la computadora. ¿Sí? Ah, ok. Eh, vaya hacia arriba en your computer. Ajá. Ay, permítame, permítame que no me... Porque acuerdo. solo me sale usted, Silvia y... Ah... Pero si gusta... Um, Hay una opción donde dice ver participantes sin video. Creería que lo tiene desactivado. Sí, Por eso solo le aparece sí. los que tienen como una picture o something. Ah, ya, ya, ya. Sí, ya vi. No tiene la pantalla en pequeño. No, no, ya me salieron. Eso estaba desactivado, exactly. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Ah, pues si gusta, Silvina, es que le pregunte a Jorge Alberto, teacher. Jorge creo que está working. Ah, but, eh, chicos, nos confirma quiénes están. I'm here. Me okay, so sure. Mr. Okay. Amaya is here. Ah, no, guys, you have Mr. Amaya here. But Juan Antonio, eh, creo I'm que es un momento. Teacher. Sorry. Yes, no worries, no worries. I remember your message. Uh, Juan, are you here? Iván, están acá, guys. Yes, mm -hmm. Ah, aquí está Juan también. Mm -hmm. Ivan, are you with us? Yes, teacher. Ah, vaya, guys. So, ahí tienen para que eh, you enjoy it. <laughs> and you interact. Thank you. Guys. Solo yes. una cosita eh, con este verbo, con el primero. Eh, podemos cambiarla sin problema, right? We can change it. Eh, but si es este verbo, eh, perdón, esta palabra, este auxiliar sería would. 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 Uh, would. Would you like? Would you like? Perfect. Mm -hmm. Very good. There you go. Okay, guys. So, los dejo un momentito para que puedan practicar okay. y voy a ver los demás. Bueno. Hola, hola, uh -huh. Silvia. Sí. <laughs> ¿Seguimos nosotros o se va a agregar algo otro compañero? Para ver si se le pregunta a Iván. Y uh -huh. que más, dos más dijeron que... Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Si gusta usted... Con, con Carlos Amaya, no sé. Ajá, ajá. Mm, Carlos Amaya. Yes, I'm here. Aquí usted me ayuda porque está avanzadito. <laughs> a ver. Ok. Vamos a ver. Dijo la palabra. Sí, ¿eh? uh -huh. 
what, what would you like for dinner? What would you like for dinner? Yeah. Mm, I would like um, a pizza. In the dinner, Barbaros. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> a pepperoni pizza. Ah, I like the pizza, the, eh, ¿cómo se llama? Eh, Piña, se me, se me ha ido el... el, el Hawaiiana. Hawaiiana. Uh, I don't like it. No, why? No, I don't know. No. You don't like it? Oh my God, guys, come on. Do you like pineapple? Yes, I, I, I like pineapple, but no in the... Pizza. Not in pizza? Okay. No. Uh, I have heard that. People say, oh, that's so disgusting. Yeah, but, but, but that's I tried my favorite. The, <laughs> yeah, I tried uh, the Hawaiian, but mm, that is my favorite. Oh, but okay. I tried it. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, that sounds okay. Guys, what about the rest of you? Would you like some Hawaiian pizza? Uh, pizza? I see. I like the, the, the Hawaiian <laughs> pizza. Okay. I prefer, I think I prefer pupusas more than pizza. Mm -mm. Me teacher. I do <laughs> like for dinner. Ivan, what would you like? Um, sure, sure. Uh, I got the... <laughs> Really? <laughs> oh, I'm Camarone sorry. Ah, shrimps. Shrimps. Mm -hmm. Do you like some shrimps? Okay. Uh, mm -hmm. Octopus. Um, um, <gasps> octopus. <laughs> octopus. <laughs> <laughs> no. I'm like, oh, oh no, oh, I don't. <laughs> really bad, really bad question. <laughs> I'm on a, I'm on a, on, I'm on a permanent diet. So, <laughs> okay. Oh, that sounds good. But I Ivan, can you cook? Sorry. Can you cook? Yeah. Like See? Cook? Yes. Yes. Ah, uh, okay. Yes, teacher. Like octopus and shrimps, can you cook them? Uh, yes. Um, a la parrilla. Um, mm -hmm. Grill. Uh, grill. <laughs> grill. 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 Um, um, plancha, como se dice, ticho. I need to investigate that, but, but that is grilled. Ah, uh -huh. really? es que se les conozco como grilled. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Um. It's a minor teacher. Minor. Hello. Minor is here, but por alguna razón no lo he logrado escuchar, you know? So, mm -hmm. creería que está como, uh, yeah. Como mm. gente, that's mm. and Catherine, I believe too. Mm -hmm. mm. Juan Antonio, pero Juan Antonio, sí, like he, he was talking uh, some seconds ago. So there you go, mm. Juan Antonio. How are you? Hi, 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 <laughs> Juan Antonio. What could you like for uh, the uh, lunch? Oh, not, mm. Sería, what would you like for dinner? Pero lo estoy cambiando por eh, lunch. Yeah. How would, would, would you like for lunch? I would like pizza. For lunch, <laughs> yes, pizza. Pizza, really? <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow. Ivan, este, del sitio. 
Eh, también le gusta la pizza. Yes. yes. Ya somos tres, Dios mío. Sí. I, I, I will love to the pizza, la vamos a decir. <risa> vamos pizza. a ver. Pizza con camarones. Ay, sí. No, guácala. No, también. Yo no, nunca jamás la había probado con camarones. Pero Ay, es pizza. que... Pizza. pizza con langosta. No, ahí no, así no la he probado. Con camarones. No, eh, creo que esa vez probé con que habían hecho una de cangrejo, creo que era. No de, no de camarones. Really? Yes, pero I no, I don't like la pizza con, de cangrejo. No. Uh -huh. esa, esa, esa no me la sabía yo. De verdad, ay, no, no me gustó. Pero sí, invento de la gente de Estados Unidos. Bueno. Vamos a ver, Carlitos. What concert would you like to go to? Go to go sería, ¿verdad? What concert would, would you like to go to? Concert. What concert? Va a venir Gilberto Santa Rosa, ¿verdad? Vamos. Do you like concert Gilberto Santa Rosa? I don't sure. I don't like concert. Ah? No, I don't like any concert. <laughs> ah, pero le gusta la, eh, do you like the music de Gilberto Santa Rosa? Mm. Tom sería ver, son de Gilberto Santa Rosa. I don't know who is he. <laughs> de verdad. Carlitos, yeah. what they are all? <laughs> I'm 28. Ah, uh, 20. Yeah. Wow. 28. 28. Wow. Con, con, con razón. <laughs> yeah, but, but if I hear some music, maybe I, I, I think that I recognize the, the song. Ay, con yes. razón. <laughs> Ay, no. Ahí sí ya es, es ese tipo de... de, de... De, ya ahí ya me quedé atrás yo. <risa> Bye. Entonces veamos. What did you eh, sería? What eh, no sería? Would you like to watch the the favorite eh, movie? What ah no sería? What do you like to watch favorite movie? La number six. One. No, One. estoy preguntándole, ajá, como dijo la teacher, que podíamos cambiar las preguntas. Estoy oh, okay. preguntando, what you would you like to the favorite new, eh, movie? Oh, ok, ¿cuál es mi película sí, favorita? Exactly. Ajá. Ah, pues el, la cuestión sería de que ahí no, no iría el would. What would you like? Ah, what do you like? Pregunté. To watch the favorite movie. ¿O cuál sería ahí? Este. Ya como en la séptima sería. Como en la séptima. Ah, sí, sí, sí. What movie, what movie would you like to watch? Ajá. Uh -huh. Favorite movie. Um, pero ahí está bien así, o sea, what movie would you like to watch? Sí, ahí está el what, sí, what. Uh -huh. like. Solamente así, sin, uh -huh. sin el, no. el favorite. Ah, vaya, to watch. Ajá. Uh -huh. uh -huh. um, I would like, I would like to watch, um, the Conjuring. What? Conjuring. Ah, y esa es movie. Sí, the, the Conjuring. El ah. conjuro. Ajá, uh -huh, pues sí, por eso te digo. Wow. <laughs> ah, va. Sí. Wow. The, the favorite is the horror, ¿verdad? O terror. <laughs> um, es de miedo, ¿verdad? Yes. Not fair. I fair in the movie. 
<risa> Vaya, pero ahí también tenemos a Silvia Inés que me está ayudando y Carlitos también. No sé a quién le quiere preguntar. Es que no sé quiénes más estarán ya. Eh, Carlitos está ahorita en línea. Uh -huh. Ay. Es que casi todos ya. Vamos a ver. My, uh -huh. my favorite uh, movie is karate, comedy. Mm. Really? Karate? No, no. Karate. Eh, cinta, ¿cómo se dice cinta negra? C cinta black. Black top. Ah, sería black top. Wow. Yes. Uh, comedy. De comedia. Ah, de comedia, ajá. Uh -huh. Romantic, no. Uh -huh. <ríe> o oh, sí. I don't know. Uh -huh. I don't know. ¿Por qué, pues? <ríe> Why? Uh, no sé cómo se dice. Es. Ajá. Uh -huh. um, Romántica es cuando. Romantic. Ajá. Romantic. I don't know. It's a romantic. No. De suspenso. De suspenso. Ajá. Y Cartoon Network, do you like? Ya no, vea. Cartoon Network casi ya no se no mira. No lo conoció. No. Sí, ya me acordé. Sí, sí. Ay, no. El Cartoon Network es eh, las caricaturas que antes mirábamos, pero yo creo que ya en esos tiempos ya casi no vea. <ríe> ¿Usted sí, Silvia Inés? Yo sí. <ríe> What is your favorite Cartoon Network? <ríe> Iván, veamos. <ríe> Iván, what, uh, what eh, Cartoon Network eh, would you like to watch? Um... Eh, eh, Star, eh, ¿cómo se dice? Este, de, de los Caballeros del Zodiaco es como. ¡Oh! ¡Wow! Apostero de mis tiempos. <risa> Las. Ajá. Yeah. Guado. Sí. Ajá. Guado. Um, aún quiero ver cómo se dice. Ajá. Um, Hace poco salió la película, vea. Yes. Uh -huh. Es cierto. Ya vemos la. Teacher. <laughs> hello. Hello, teacher. Hello, hello. So we are back. Okay, guys. So tell us what is it? Encontraron información importante. ¿Qué les dijeron los compañeros? What did they say? Now, vamos a reportar qué es lo que me dijo el compañero utilizando um, like the name of the person, right? And then would like to. So would like to. So, vamos a, a intentar reportarlo. Uh -huh. uh, so, guys, ¿qué les dijeron? What did they say? Ay, ahorita eh, sería Iván. Uh -huh. eh, would like to the uh -huh. eh, Cartoon Network Caballeros del Zodiaco. He would like to watch. <laughs> ah, ok. The Zodiac. So the Zodiac Nights. Do you uh -huh. have a favorite? I would like. Is a favorite Goku. <laughs> ah, okay. Wait, but that is Los Caballeros del Zodiaco or, or Dragon Ball? It, uh, Dragon Ball, también. Ah, it's so Dragon Ball. Sure. You would like to watch Dragon yeah. Ball and the Zodiac Knights. Ah, okay, okay. So okay. The... That's okay. Guys, what about the rest? ¿Qué recuerdan? What do you remember? Um, Silvia dijo que es romántica. Yeah. Ah, vaya, cuéntenos, she said, vamos a agregarle acá un pedacito más. So es como ella dijo, she said. She said, um, romantic. Ok. 
Silvia said she would like to. ¿Qué es lo que le gustaría hacer? O, o ser más romántica. Or, or, how was that? <laughs> or ver películas románticas. What was the idea? I like uh, to movies romantic. Ah, like to watch, like to watch. Okay, to watch. for example, Titanic and things like those. <laughs> oh, okay, okay, that's okay. Teacher, my bueno, no me recuerdo el compañero que dijo, pero eh, el hijo que uh -huh. a ver sería good he life said, to the uh -huh. his he said good life to the movie. The que era <laughs> de miedo horror movies uh -huh. terror terror. De, ah, terror perdón terror oh okay sí podemos utilizar horror el, so... el conjuro el ay oh. el conjuro Dios why? Mío. the conjuring yes why do you want to watch the conjuring <laughs> aren't you afraid I love it are you serious? Yes. Aren't you afraid that somebody is going to drag you? Yes, but I love it. <laughs> I know, teacher. No, it's dramatic. ¿Cómo puede dormir? How can you sleep? Ese día tengo pesadillas. How do you say pesadillas? I go to the <laughs> cinema to <laughs> see it. Nightmares. Uh -huh. Ah, okay, okay. Okay. No, pero en el cinema no da miedo, sir. Those are nightmares. Like pesadillas, right? Okay, what what movie would you like to watch? What horror movie? So, ¿qué película de miedo? What horror movie would you like to watch? The I Conjuring, you said? Uh, Mystery. I Which was the... Misery. Misery, Misery, Misery. Mm -hmm. Pero no es de un libro de Stephen King. Uh, creo que sí. Oh, yo leí el libro, I read the book. Es una película, is that a movie? Pues hay una película que se llama Misery, es como de terror psicológico. I'm gonna check that out. Probably, because Stephen King normalmente es like horror and thrillers. Ah, bueno, okay. sí, 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 sí. Ajá, yeah, because Carrie, It, todos, todos son de Stephen King. Yeah, perdón, Silvia, díganos, díganos. Hola. Está esta otra película que se llama The Other Door, door algo así, The al otro lado door? de la puerta. Ajá, okay. al otro lado de la puerta. Esa, yo la vi. horror? Me dio miedo, sí. Oh. Me dio miedo. Oh, my God. No, guys. Mr. Amaya, no sé cómo aguantan. I don't know how you can watch horror movies. ¿Qué más ve de terror, guys? Who watches horror movies? Me. El amanecer del diablo. <laughs> ah, pero esa es uh, el nombre sí. diferente en in inglés, I think. Um, por dos, I watch movies. But at night. Yes. Why not? Why? <laughs> okay. okay. That's crazy. <laughs> no, it's fine. If you like it, it's fine. But don't you feel scared? No. No. I saw the noon too. The noon. Yes. Ah, the noon. The, noon, the, the like the I have yeah. I think I saw movie number one. The 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 woman that appears like with the covered. I don't know how to call that thing. Yeah, the noon. I have to look for that. Okay. So you saw one and two. The the two of them. No. It's just one, the noon. Wait, I think I saw one. Yes, it's but just I one. I don't remember. It's just oh. one movie. Okay, but I don't want to see that again. <laughs> that was okay. <laughs> that was enough for me. Okay. It's okay. Uh, the Conjuring. It's um um based on the. Um, the, I think. Um. Yes, Annabelle. One, two, three. The Conjuring. It's like a. Um, they are connected. 
Oh, yeah, right. Uh -huh. That's what I know. Yeah, with the noon. With the noon. Oh. The noon, too. Yeah. Okay. That part I didn't know. But I don't like... I don't really like water because later when I go to the bathroom, I'm like, oh, my God, oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> so, well, yeah, I am super scared of those things. Okay. Guys, what about the rest of you? Uh, what kind of movies would you like to watch? Road to the ground. Road to the ground. What is that, uh, Ivan? Is the name of a horror movie too? Road to the ground. Eh, Camino hacia el terror. Pero ese es el nombre de la película. Is that the movie's name? Uh, uh, yes, ahí está la primera, segunda. Uh, mm. Creo que hay cuatro. cuatro. Pero el, eh, creería que el nombre es diferente, you know, because las películas de inglés al español el nombre cambia totalmente. So, Road to the Ground. ¿Cuál es el nombre en español? Camino al terror, you said. Yes. Pero ¿cuál es? Like, que aparece un carrito, ¿no? Yes. Ah, sí, ya sé cuál es. Ok, uh, so in English, in English, <ríe> eso <ríe> tiene un nombre que nada que ver. Eso se llama Ron Turn. <ríe> Super diferente, really different. So, Like, there is one that is called Arrastrame al Infierno or something like that. Pero en español, pero that's Spanish. Pero el nombre en inglés es nada que ver, you know, super different. Okay, so sounds okay. All right, guys, let's go on. ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más recuerdan? ¿Qué les contaron los compañeros? What did they mention, guys? Uh, el concierto, dijeron. Um... Mm -hmm. Um, I remember uh, someone in the group said she would like to go to Bad Bunny's concert. Silvia? <laughs> uh, Santa Rosa. Who? Uh, ¿Quién dijo? Exactly, Who said that? Exactly. <laughs> ¿Quién lo dijo? Who said that? We. Uh, ah, Nicola. you would like to go to Ah, ok. You like to go to Gilberto Santa Rosa. Ok. ¿Qué más recuerdan, guys? Tell us. Sandra, what do you remember? The, uh, um, the, the, what, uh, sería, what, what, uh, what would you like for dinner? Y dice, eh, ellos, eh, sería, eh, creo que Carlos fue. Carlos, okay. eh, would like the pizza? Ah, ok. Eh, también este Juan Antonio, si no me recuerdo. Ok. Uh -huh. Más la pizza hawaiana. So he would like some Hawaiian pizza. Ok. Ok, ok. Pepperoni, teacher, pepperoni. Ah, yeah. He said that he wouldn't like uh, pineapple pizza, right? I remember. <laughs> ok. So he would like some pepperoni. What else, guys? ¿Qué más recuerdan que les contaron? Uh, Dalila says, ¿qué recuerdan? What do you remember? Dalila say that they would like to move to Atlanta because uh, for the for the weather. It's oh, okay. Cool, but she go to Canada to visit. <laughs> so not to move, just to visit. Yes, but for the weather. They, uh, she wouldn't go to Atlanta, but mm -hmm. when I ask what country would you like to visit, she says uh, to Canada. Okay, okay. Maybe just to visit, right? Not to move. Because mm -hmm. move is, uh, implica todo, irse a vivir, right? Probably just to visit. Okay, okay, okay. What else, guys? What do you remember? Where, where would, would like to go Italia? 
Ah, so Italy. Why? Did he say why Italy? Sorry? Did, did he say why? No, sorry. No? No, no, no explico <laughs> por qué. He didn't explain. Because it's Italy. Italy is beautiful. Is 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 history is is interesting. Ah, okay. Do you have family in Italy? Um, no, no. Uh, he's he, uh, I uh, we lie in France. Mm -hmm. In Italy, uh, we family no friends, yes. Okay, so you have friends in Italy and in France, but no family. Yes. Okay. Yes. In Italy, where would you like to go? Uh, like. uh, Italy. Uh, yes. Is in Milan. Uh, okay. So just for the history. Yes, in uh, Roma is this time is um, uh, is two tam también. Two uh -huh, so Rome, Milan, the Vatican, you know. Um, the Vatican. Uh -huh, it's uh, also uh, very famous. Aunque tengo entendido que el Vaticano es como que actúa como algo independiente. Mm -hmm. That's what I heard. Que es un un país el solito, but. But I would like to go, you know, yes. solo por el arte, because I really like the, the art and the buildings. And wow, the 16th chapel, uh, chapel, I have read the La Capilla 16, or like the sixth uh, uh, chapel, and that looks very, very interesting. Okay, okay guys, mm -hmm. but, um, very nice job with this. So that's actually very, very cool. Uh, vamos a trabajar, guys, un poquito el listening now. Preguntas, tienen, uh, les costó responder alguna de ellas, or hay algo que se les olvidaba, or you were having difficulties with them, or estamos bien, are we good? We're good. Just good. in the number two, would you like to move to Atlanta? I just say, I have to sleep on it. That's it. Oh, what do you mean? <laughs> I have to sleep on it. If somebody asks me that question. You have to sleep on it. Yes. Uh, but, but I don't get how. <laughs> <laughs> I have to sleep on it. Is that okay. a joke I'm missing? <laughs> no. No. Okay. It's like, uh, lo consultaré con la almohada. Oh, okay. I'm like, okay. I, I thought you meant uh, something. Wait. Okay. So you meant something literal. So I was like, oh, what? <laughs> okay. Okay, okay. Give me one second, guys. Okay, guys, so we're gonna practice a little bit of listening. And I have some exercises uh, for you. So, okay, okay, I think it's fine. So we are going to uh, apply, as you mentioned last time, that it was a little easier cuando trabajaban juntos, so vamos a intentar work together uh, again to practice or to complete this exercise. Um, here we have four conversations. Vamos a trabajar solamente in conversation one and uh, that'll be it. So the conversation is quite easy. Se las acabo de enviar. I just sent it. Uh, son four but ya practicamos la tres y la cuatro, so uh, I'm going to give you, see, I'm gonna give you 10 minutes para que puedan escribir, so you can write the two conversations, number one and number two, están bien cortitas, they are very short, 
and the, uh, take all the notes you can, right? Si pueden escribirle al pie de la letra, that would be amazing, but if not, no hay ningún problema. There is no problem at all. So, um, se los acabo de compartir, me confirman si lo pueden escuchar. So, give me confirmation if you can hear that. And intentemos trabajarlo en grupo, right? So, si ya lo tienen, if you have it, Váyanse compartiendo what you have, que es lo que entendieron, para que sea easier and vayamos haciendo eh, cooperative learning too. Give me just a moment. Okay, my bad. Okay, guys, so I'm going to send you to the group so you can practice. Uh, we have 10 minutes for the two conversations, right? And let's write them down. Okay, there we go. 10 minutes, guys. Let's go ahead and write down the conversations.
Welcome back, guys. So thanks a lot for coming back. How was your practice? <laughs> Les dio dolor de cabeza. Did you get it? Lo pudieron completar. Which was more difficult, number one or number two? Number two. Number two. Okay, so what about number one? ¿Cómo les fue con la primera? Were you able to complete it? ¿Sí la pudieron completar? Very easy, the two. Oh, the okay. Two. Okay. That's but it nice is British English, right? Um, what would you ask? Uh, no, I don't think so. so. Allow me one second. Yeah, let's go yeah, I, I, hear I, I heard that was normal, but wait, 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 wait. Like to um, the man, yes, 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 you're right. There is a little bit of British, but um, not much, you know, so yeah, but there is a little bit. Okay, guys, let's take a look at conversation one. So, de que se trató la primera? What was the first about? ¿Qué quería hacer? Uh, what would the person is she wants to be like to chef be? and she wants she wants to um, open her restaurant. Okay, what kind of restaurant? Oh. I don't remember. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Let me show I you I don't guys. know what kind of, of food is that. And let's see if we get it. So this is conversation one. La pueden confirmar. You can double check your notes, right? Um, and the person says, what do you want to do in the future? I'd like to be a chef, right? So I want to uh, have my own restaurant. What kind of food would you like to cook? I'd like to cook Greek food, right? So Greek is this one, like the, from the country, from Greece. Uh, oh, and if you do that, I want to eat there. I'd like that. So that was the first. So, lo tienen más o menos, is it kind of close, tienen algunas palabras, like, ¿qué tanto se acerca to the conversation? 80%, 90%. ¿Y qué tanto se parece a lo que ustedes comprendieron? <laughs> How similar is it? So, si la comprendieron like this, it was very close. Dalila? No, but, uh, okay, so, ¿cuál fue la parte que se le hizo más complicada? What was the most complicated part? I the pronunciation. Pronunciation, okay. De hecho, es, es un acento tal vez un poquito más fuerte el del hombre, the man's accent, pero the her is American accent. So, all right, all right. So, si esta era la más fácil, guys, what about the second one? <laughs> Eso se la voy a dejar de tarea. I'm going to give that as a homework for you para que la pongan, la pongan, la pongan, and you get it. Solo les voy a dar un little eh, tip. So, number two se refiere a Bill Gates, right? So, estamos hablando de this famous eh, a multi-millionaire, right? or a millionaire, uh, that is Bill Gates. So, se las dejo, guys, para que la puedan trabajar during the weekend. Um, antes de irnos solo, I would like to listen to uh, some people read the conversation, especialmente porque tenemos la contracción de I would, right, and um, who would like to participate, guys? ¿Quién quiere leer? Who wants to read? Me. Me, teacher. Okay, thank you, Ivan. So help me with the part that says man. And Sylvia Ignes, ayúdame con la parte que dice woman, please. Okay. Okay. What do you What do you want to do in the future? I like to be a chef. I want to have my own restaurant. What kind of food would you like to cook? 
I like to cook great food. Oh, if you that, I want to eat there. I like that. Oh, that was really nice. Very good pronunciation. And the choice is el sonido de la contracción de at, right? So very good, very good job. All right, guys. So um, unfortunately, time is over and uh, we have a couple of things, right, to work on, especially in the platform, that are related with these topics. Um, guys, quick question. Ya les funcionó a quienes les estaba dando problema el ejercicio 4? ¿Pudieron completarlo? Were, were you able to complete it? Yes, teacher. Okay. So, Aún no lo termina, teacher. Todavía no. Eh, <laughs> ¿Le ha dado algún yeah. problema o o por cuestión de tiempo? Por cuestión de tiempo, hasta ahorita ah, no lo he pasado. Uh -huh. oh, yeah, no worries, that's okay. Um, tenemos hasta el día de mañana, guys. We have until tomorrow, porque mañana en la noche envío los reportes. Entonces, para no afectarlos, eh, try to work on it, right? And si tiene tiempo ahora o mañana, so you can continue working on that. Eh, recordemos que es, ahora es la sesión número dos, number two. Algunos ya la terminaron toda, así que I don't need to remind you, but es la número dos. Si pueden avanzar, you can, you know, complete as many exercises as you want already. Eh, si, tienen eh, si tienen dificultades, creería que va a ser con el ejercicio número cuatro porque um, hay un pequeño error de formato, let's say, and donde está la parte de would like, de hecho, les fal le falta la parte de, um, de like, too, que es lo que veíamos en las clases anteriores, right, y cómo completarlo. So, eh, solamente quiten el punto final en, en, las, en los dos primeros ejercicios de la parte número cuatro, les tendría que estar funcionando. It should work. Creo que con Juan Antonio lo revisamos ayer, right? And, y ya funcionó. So it worked. Okay. Alrighty, guys. So, solo les tomo asistencia. Allow me one moment para que ya se pueden ir a descansar. So we can rest a little. Y disfrutar de su fin de semana para quienes no trabajan mañana. So give me one second here. <coughs> Okay. Okay, guys. So, regalen me confirmation, please. Give me some confirmation. I have. Okay, I have Carlos Reyes. Gracias, Carlos. Ceci. Thank you. Cesar. Present. Thank you. Uh, Yvonne. Present. Dalila. Present. Thanks a lot, Ivan. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Joel. Present teacher. Thank you. Jonathan, creo que no lo vi ahora. No, he's not here. Um, Jorge, yeah, Jorge is here. Juan Antonio. Present. So, ah, no, ahora sí, ya lo vi, ya lo vi igual, you know. <laughs> so yesterday I was like, oh, you look different. Eh, Mr. Amaya, por ahí está Mr. Amaya. Here. Eh, thank you. Karen. Thank you. Maynard, too. Eh, Sandra. Sandra. Present. Thank you. Silvestela. Present teacher. Thanks a lot. And Silvia Ines. Thank you so much. All right, guys. So thank you for your time. Que descansen. Have an amazing night. And I hope to see you on Monday. So bye bye, guys. Bye. Have a nice see you on Monday. Have a good one. Not here.